Hello Zebra Herd, welcome back to Super Mario Odyssey. Today there is a brand new costume in the Crazy Cab Shop. Of course, the last two costumes we've had have been brutal stuff. It looks like it's the same thing here. We have the Harriet hat and the Harriet suit. This is the third out of the four that we can get and the only female character out of the brutals, or at least the main four brutals, I guess. I mean, there is the big lady with the chain chomp. Anyways, we have the Harriet hat, a hat you should not wear until after thoroughly checking it for explosives. And then also the Harriet suit and all Hourly, love, hourly lovely gown, the interior structure has rotted away and is holding on by a thread. Okay, well, hopefully she goes clothes shopping soon. Um, with that being said, let's go ahead and try try this on. We're gonna probably be as interesting as Mario in the wedding dress or something like that, but uh, yeah. It's gonna be looking beautiful. And we'll go ahead and we'll play on some of the kingdoms that Harriet shows up on. The first one she shows up in is Sand Kingdom. We look wonderful. Um, <laughs> I love the heels, you know, like Mario platforming around in heels, that sounds difficult. But yeah, we'll go ahead and we'll play some Sand Kingdom because that's where we first run in to Harriet. So here we are at the Sand Kingdom. We're gonna be doing some Luigi's Balloon World, like always, just because that's really the only thing we can do at this point. Anyway, looking good, bro. <laughs> I mean, I guess, I wanna say hey, looking good, sis at this rate, but uh, if we take a look, as you can see, I've been making fantastic progress with Luigi's Balloon World. There's only one more star I need to get. It's quite the doozy. I need to find another 178 balloons, so that's gonna be taking me a little while, but we can make some more progress with that, but I've done all of the fi or the hind it, the hide it balloon, so I don't have to worry about that anymore, which is great because I always prefer find it over hide it. But yeah, I've been just sort of doing that uh, in my spare time, which isn't too often, but maybe this will help. Maybe we can just find a couple more. In today's episode, I'll be a tiny bit closer. But yeah, this is not the, well, is this? No, no, no. I guess, I can't remember. Where's the first time we fight Harriet? Is it up there? I think it's up there. You get to the top of the inverted triangle and you fight Harriet. And that's the first time you go against her. So that's pretty cool. So that's why I figured it'd be fun to start things off here. Of course, the last episode was for, well, might not have been last episode, but the last time we played as a costume, Oh yeah, yeah, it was uh, it was Rango, and we did the lake for that. Also, I'm not doing this the right way, am I? Oh gosh, whoa, <laughs> okay, definitely not doing this the right way. Sort of forgot that the time is of the essence. I was trying to collect coins to get me more seconds, but it'd be faster probably, because how much time do I have? 37 seconds, which is pretty good, honestly. But I think that if I, there we go. That used to be so difficult for me when Luigi's Balloon World first came out. Crazy how much easier it is for me now. Ooh. There we go. So I don't know exactly which way I'm going. I mean, I know I'm making some good progress. Either which way. Okay, so it looks like it goes down a lot when I go this way. Oh, it's right there. Ooh, okay, so it's over the goop. So I'm gonna try to play this a little safe. And just, okay, there we go. Not a bad start. <laughs> I like it. So that was a bit of a tough one to begin with. But uh, I mean, those invisible platforms are still there. You just can't see them without the Moai head or being the Moai head, but that's fine. Yeah, we spent a lot of coins getting the uh, Harriet stuff. 8,000, I think, in total. So let's try to make sure we're earning up coins wherever we can. So it looks like we're going down this way for now. Sort of one, no, 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 no. That was the wrong thing to do. <laughs> okay, that's not gonna get me any coins back if I just fall to my doom. Let's try that again. Uh. I mean, it's only 15 coins. We're definitely getting a much larger reward than that. What is the button I need to press? Nothing, I just gotta shake the controller. But that gets us an extra second and doesn't take us an entire second. Oh, I see it. Oh. No! Oh, I thought I'd get a little hat bounce off of that. I guess not. Okay, Ooh. no, Mari, don't fall, don't fall. <laughs> Come on, I don't even need it to be like perfect timing. I just need to get to it. And there we go! Mario is looking dashing in this outfit. The weird thing about it though is that you can see Mario's arms, which are white and like, you know, supposed to be like the bunny fur, but then he has the normal head. Obviously the whole thing is supposed to be a costume, but that's just weird to think about. It must be uncomfortable. Uh, for now though, we're going this way. Oh, I can see it up there. So what he probably did is he went this way. Yeah, it's almost 400 meters away. We can handle that. I know exactly what we're doing. We're just gonna go and boop, got it. And we're gonna go ahead to the very corner. Of the, yeah, this won't be too much of a problem at all. There might have been in a different way, like maybe even a faster way, who knows? But uh, I don't really have to worry about it too much. If this works, it works. And we still have like 15, 14 seconds left over. That's pretty good. So uh, yeah, I think we did just fine. With that being said, 
What else do we got going on? There's some interesting balloons. That's sort of what I like about the Sand Kingdom's balloon world is it's pretty spread out. You can get a fair variety of different balloons. Um, some of the other the kingdoms, of course, I say that as soon as we get like a repeat of what we just got, but um, a lot of the other kingdoms are just so much smaller than the Sand Kingdom. The Sand Kingdom, like when it comes to the amount of actual like walkable terrain, is definitely one of the largest kingdoms. So it's, it's definitely interesting for Balloon World. It gives sort of a fair variety of different things to get to. I sort of wish there were more super large kingdoms in um, Odyssey as there were Sand Kingdom. I mean, I'm sure at some point, maybe we'll get like some DLC kingdoms or something. I think it's gonna be up right down there. Not bad, pretty easy to find once he pieces together. I mean, usually if it's 400 meters in that direction, it's gonna have something to do with that building. All right, it's 99 coins there. I mean, we're getting our coins back slowly but surely. Oh, three in a row, so we get some extra coins. And what do we got now, the 300? Okay, now I, I talk about how original these can be, and then I don't get any of the original ones. Let's try something different then. Uh, something that might be a little bit more risky, but could give us a bigger reward, like this one. Oh, I see it. You know what, if we could do the same thing we did before, with the one where I needed the Moai head technically, Oh boy. Whoa, the perspective was wrong. Whoops. If I fail this one a lot, I'm gonna end up losing coins. So I gotta be careful, I gotta be confident I'm gonna be able to do it. I just gotta do it better. Okay, attempt number two. If I pay 95 coins, I'm still getting a good bonus of coins. Ready, ooh. Okay, there we go. Okay, the only problem now is that I'm running out of time. Ooh. So where is it? Oh geez, wait, wait where'd it go? Have I missed it? I guess I did. Okay, where in the world is the balloon? I thought it was just right here. Wait, am I doing this all wrong? <laughs> I have no clue, where, where'd it go? Huh. All right, well this one might have me a little something. Maybe it's under one of the things, one of the broken blocks. I don't know, this one might not work out, so we'll just go ahead and take our losses. Cause I don't know where this one is. Different balloon. Yeah, I thought that coin in the distance, I thought that was the balloon. But I guess now that I see it, it sort of looks more like a coin. Oh well, that's my mistake. Where's this one at? Definitely he glid over there. But I feel like it'd be faster. Maybe not though, Oh, hard to say. Hard to say. I feel like it'd be faster to just take the power line. Uh, I know you probably did this way, so I'll try it this way and see what, ha what ends up happening. It shouldn't be too bad, but I, I almost have a feeling that if you went that way and got the jacksy with the power, like you went down the power cord, grab the jacksy and then sort of cut over there, I think that'd be fine too. But I don't know, I definitely think it'd be faster just to, oh geez, come on Mario, get on your feet. Okay, so where in the world is this balloon? Oh, I see it, I see it over the horizon. Okay, so that shouldn't be too bad. All I need to do is one, one, two, three. Perfect, nice. Boom, so we were able to get it that way. Was it the fastest way? Not necessarily, but that's fine. Okay, not bad. So what do we got next? That was 99 more coins. I wanna do something a little bit more expensive, but also not utterly fail at it. Where is this one at? We have 10 seconds to find it, so maybe a bit of a mistake to do this one. I just don't know where it could be. We're just gonna shake our controller like crazy. We're getting real close, and it's right there, yeah, three seconds left. Did pretty good on that one, not too bad. Okay, so, we're just gonna keep doing, like I'm actually having fun with the Sand Kingdom today. Sometimes it gets a little, a little annoying, but I feel like right now I'm having a good time with it. Maybe it's because we're in our element with Harriet. So where is this one? I feel like this one's gonna be sneaky, like it's pocketed away somewhere I might have a hard time actually getting to, but we'll try it. Maybe I can actually get a good bonus in coins. Hmm, because it is sort of kind of pointing down. I don't think we can go in here, right? It won't let us. Or will it? No, no, it just <laughs> spits us back out. No, you mustn't, I know, but how was I supposed to know? Oh, geez. No, 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 it has to be somewhere around here. No, it goes back up. Oh, there it is! Oh, oh, no! <laughs> That's not fair! Oh, no! Come on, the spikes of her head are hitting the balloon! Oh, well, I found you out. I have found that balloon. I'm gonna go back and get that. <laughs> that was great. That's a really sneaky spot, too. 
It doesn't take a lot of hard work to get it there. Which is a shame, because I'm gonna pop it. So sorry to ruin your fun. But at the same time, it impacts my own fun. Oh, whoa, <laughs> okay. That was a little scary. We made it work though, it's fine. That was that was quite the maneuver going on there. Could have definitely messed that one up. Okay, another. that was only 99 coins? Oh man, that was a tough one for 99. So this one, apparently we have 22 seconds to find this one only 73 meters away. Okay. Where could it be? Not like under there or something, is it? Ooh, this one's tricky, isn't it? Oh my, um. Where could it be? I have no clue. Is this one glitched? No, I know exactly where it is. I'm being such a dingus, it's on the other side of that. I know exactly where it is. Should have pieced it together sooner. But at the same time, I don't play this kingdom a lot, so a bit of a tricky one if you don't, but there's a little thing right here. Boom. Excellent timing this time. Hopefully that'll make up for the money I had to put in originally. That was great. Okay, so nice work. Tons of coins. This one's heading this way. Oh, see, that one's in the spot I thought the other one was in before. All right. Ooh. There we go. Look at that. That was amazing. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Great time with that one. I like it. So, that was pretty good. So we got 90, that was just another 99 coins one, but I mean, that's still some decent money. We're, we were at 2,000 coins, so we've almost made 1,000 coins in total. So where is this one? This one is like a big payout. This is the one I sort of messed up before though, I think. 15 seconds to find it, I don't really know for sure where it is. I feel like that's too much of a risk. We could do something like this, a little bit maybe easier going. 115 for 396, a big payout if we do succeed. Okay, so 32 meters downwards. I mean, the chances are pretty high it's gonna be down here if it actually lets you go in here. This is the weird part, I don't think it does. Oh no, I'm wrong, it's over here. Wait, oh geez, does it let you down in here in Balloon World though? I don't remember, I don't think so. So I don't know where it could be. I mean, there's a couple of other places we could poke around, but once again, this is a risky one. We can end up losing more coins than we stand to gain. Oh yeah, it's gonna be down here, right? Maybe, no, actually not at all. It has to be down here then. Right, yup, okay, I thought that you couldn't get it down here. I feel like I've tried that before. Oh well, we figured it out. Not a, not, not a bad spot, it was pretty sneaky. Okay, 396 coins. Uh, so we still ended up making money there. Let's take a look at some other stuff. 145 for 495 is pretty good. It's trying to find out exactly, this one might be another sneaky one, just like we had before, where it's like stuck on a little piece of the corner or whatever. We'll have to find out together. Ready, one, two, three. Okay, I've just barely made that triple jump. So I just gotta pay attention to how the meters are going down. Still going down. And then it gets slightly farther away because it's right there. No! Oh! It's not easy to do! It's really difficult. Gosh darn it, trying again. You got me once, you won't get me twice. Hopefully, I don't know. I mean, I knew what I was doing, it's just a matter of hard to do it, you know? Oh, okay. Got up, there we go. Just go quick with this so running out of time's not an issue. Okay, so, need to sort of angle this up. It's like right down there. Oh, there we go. Not bad, it's tough. You have to actually jump onto that. I think we still made some positive money. Yeah, definitely. What about this one? 318 meters this way, once again, 13 seconds. I just don't trust it because I don't, oh, I see it. At the very, very end. The thing with this one is, I think you have to pick up enough coins to last. I mean, maybe not, maybe you could rush, but I don't think so, you know? Uh, I don't think it's worth wasting 145 coins to find out. Uh, we'll, we'll just play a little bit safer with the same exact balloon. Uh, <laughs> uh, this one, I think I can see it. 
No, no, okay, that's just a coin. Um, 16 seconds again. That's like, the, every kingdom has a weird trick that only some people know of that you have to sort of decipher on your own if you really want to find it, you know? Anyways, I'm spending too much time poking around on which balloons we should do instead of just doing the balloon. So we're gonna go ahead and do this one. We've already done it in the past, but maybe this time, yeah, I can see it out there. We could try this way and see if it's any better. Because we do, you know, stand to gain some coins if we do it faster than normal. Okay, so the Jaxi is right here. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna long jump over to him, and then I'm just gonna grab you, or pop on. How, did, how does this work? There you go. Haven't, haven't ridden the Jaxi in a while, but I honestly think this is quicker. Look at this guy cheering for me. <laughs> okay, so yep, we just gotta go this way, and I'm just gonna run right into it. Definitely way better time than last time! I'm sorry, Jackson, I didn't mean to do that! <laughs> I'm just not good at angling and pointing it and everything. It's been a while. Okay, so at least we got some bonus 20 coins and two in a row, so we got some extra coins there. Um. Okay, so some of these are really easy, like I could see it right there. Let's go ahead and try this one, it's hiding behind I guess, well, not really anything. It was just those coins were in the way. But that one's super easy. So it's like, I might as well, because the return on it, the rate of return, the amount of time we're spending to get these coins is really low. So, might as well. So there's that one done. And that means that we have more to do. <laughs> 99 coins. Let's see if we can hit 5,000 coins in today's episode. At this rate, it's gonna be pretty easy, as long as we don't mess too much more up. Oh boy. Do I wanna go for that one again? Not entirely in the mood. Maybe this one, because this one gives us 198 as a reward. Oh, I see it. I see it right over there. Okay, so 28 seconds to get to that. I feel like that might be even more tricky, depending. Because there's no way to like, oh no. Oh, hey, I made it. Nice, barely. <laughs> that was a little scary. Whoa, no, oh, okay, I didn't mean to do that. I was gonna long jump. I almost booty slammed to my doom. Wow. <laughs> That was a little bit of a roller coaster. That was a really good one. We got a good couple hundred coins out of that, right? 198, then an extra 30, then an extra 118. We are storming towards, uh... oh yeah, that one's way out there. Don't think I want that one. Let's try for another 55. This one's 187 meters that way. I think it's probably in that little corridor then. That shouldn't be too bad. Like, we should be able to do that. If I just long jump this way. Yeah, it's definitely in that little, like, little thing. But yeah, we should definitely be able to reach 5,000 today, which will be fine. I mean, we had 9,999. Not much any longer, but that's okay. It happens. And it's down here. Yep, very good. I was a little worried that I don't want to be, because I only had five seconds left to figure it out after that. Well, we figured it out. It was pretty good. So there is some nice work. Um, so what about this one? 480 meters that way, I see it. So we should be able to do that same strategy again, and as long as we don't miss with the Jaxi, we should be able to get even better time than if we use Glidon. So that's my big hint I've learned for today, is that Glidon really isn't the fastest. Let's take this to the left, hop off. I mean, I guess it might even be faster to keep riding it. Whoa, come on, just land right on top of him. Pretty tough to do that, but when you make it work, you make it work. So where in the world, there it is, the balloon. Ooh, yeah! Don't have to ride the Jaxi off the cliff this time. Much faster for sure. So, 198 coins, 40 coins, 198 more coins for doing it all in a row. You get some huge rewards that way. So maybe it might actually be at this rate more profitable to just do the easy ones over and over again because they're really easy to do and you get some quick returns, you'll get the, uh, ooh, ooh, here we go, here we go, let's do this one really quickly. Um, because you get the inner row, which is honestly, at this rate, more valuable. So let's just do the easier, safer ones. I mean, that might make for a less interesting video, I don't know, maybe we'll mix it up with a hard one at the end. Uh, 99 coins, five coins, and then 118 more. Of course, it seems to be, depending on how much the original one costs, actually, I don't know if I can do this one. Um, actually, oh, I see exactly where it is. So we could do that. This one, we have to take slower. We actually land on this platform. I try to throw my hat out this way. There we go, get some extra time. Yeah, this time, it's about buying some time. I guess you could do this a little bit more quickly? In hindsight? Yeah? Okay. Maybe this was a little bit of a mistake. We'll get some extra coins out of that, which is nice. And then I can 
See, it's, it's doable this way. It's just clearly not the fastest way. And then just land on it, there you go. I mean, if, I guess, I, I don't know how else you would do it. I mean, I guess there's a couple ways. I'd have to experiment, but it worked, so I'm not gonna complain. Okay, so we got a good chunk more coins there. We already passed 5,000, might as well push for six. Uh, this one. Don't know exactly where this is, but we have 15 seconds to find it. I don't think we need Glide on. Instead, what we might want to focus on is picking up some coins along the way, because I think it's just going to be between those pillars. Okay, well, I missed a coin there. <laughs> Whoopsies. Oh, yep, right here. Okay, that wasn't too bad at all. It was just sort of a perspective kind of thing. You can't see it when you're at your starting point, so that makes it daunting. But once you sort of get into it, it's fine. Okay, that one was pretty nice, 198 coins, real easy. So this one, we know this one. This one's in the little pocket in the back. So let's go ahead and get to that. Don't even think there's any coins to grab along the way. There is like a little ring of them towards the very end of this power line that I wanna focus on so I can get some extra time out of it. You can always tell if you're shaking the controller because they'll start sparking like that. Come on, come on, come on. There we go, got two extra seconds. All right, 60 meters away, so I'm pretty sure that means it's just not here. <laughs> it's right here, got it, yeah, okay, so not so bad. We're doing pretty nice with everything. Maybe we could go for a couple more minutes, try to find a couple more balloons, and that'll be great progress for me because that means I have less balloons to deal with until we have all the stars, all 50 of them right now. We still only have 49. Okay, so what is going on this way? I don't know if I trust this one. Actually, this one doesn't look like it's as sneaky, so we should be able to do this one. We'll try it out and find out the hard way. Oh, it's just right there. That's super easy. Okay, we're fine. One, two, yep, got it. Pretty good. Also like how uh, Cappy, when you throw him, because of him being a metallic hat, Mario, like, like it makes a metallic noise when Mario jumps off of it. Like, that's a nice attention to detail. Like, this is a very, haven't like really talked about the outfit, of course, so far in today's episode. I'd love to hear your thoughts on the Harriet outfit, if you think it's good or not. I think it's, I mean, one thing in correlation with the actual character, very nice. It, it really does look like Harriet's outfit. I can see the balloon way in the distance. Um, and it looks funny on Mario, which is all I'm ever asking for. I feel like out of the three so far that we've had, out of all the three brutal things, I like this one the best. We'll have to see if that remains true. Oh, here it is. I was like, wait, where is it? Right there. Not bad, between the cacti. What does that get us up to, 6,000 yet? Oh, yeah, we're way past 6,000. Wasn't even paying attention. Just put for 99.99 again. So this one, we're starting to get some similar ones more often. This one's way in the distance, over 400 meters away. So once again, we're gonna actually choose so far what has been the faster strategy. Yeah, get two extra seconds there, because we get an extra second for every, oh gosh, that's not what I wanted. Whoa. And then land right on top, nope, not quite. Oh, there it is. Uh, we get an extra second for every three coins collected when finding a balloon. I think even when, uh, Trying to hide one as well. Oh, it's right there, okay. Sharp turn, or not. Just no turning at all. Just hop right off of them. There we go, awesome stuff. Congrats, congratulations. That was pretty good. What do we have in total now? Uh, over 7,000? Yeah, okay, there it is. So this one is over that way, ooh. Yeah, that's one of the tough ones I don't know really how to get to. I mean, I'm sure I could if I tried, but they're tough, so I'd rather not. Um. I could try for one of these. It's just a matter of, I don't really know how they do it. I don't know if it's worth risking. Okay, so this one is probably gonna be one of the ones under the uh, the quicksand, which I swear I've tried in the past and didn't work, but now it does work. I mean, hey, if it works out, great, but I swear that it used to not. Anyways, boop, got it. Okay, so congrats again. Says it every time. But I don't know if we're gonna reach 99.99 today. It'd be a little too much work, but we're at 7,500, which is fantastic. It really is. When you get a streak going on, it's just better to do the easy ones. That's what I've been doing with Mushroom Kingdom. That's by far my best way to uh, earn up. Oh no, I missed one. 
Hold on, there we go. Um, my best way to earn up the balloons popped for uh, Balloon World to get that final star is that I've been trying to uh, just do Mushroom Kingdom because I'm very comfortable with the different balloons there at this point. So when I do them, you know, I get them almost every time and build up these massive streaks. Like I gotta go check my stats to see what my highest streak is because it's gotten pretty crazy and I didn't even stop because I lost. I stopped because I had to close the game to record a video on a different game, you know? So it's been pretty crazy. With that being said, we'll do one more for today. Not the one we just did because that's a little boring. We'll, we'll go way out there for this one. We can even use Jaxi for this to save ourselves a little bit more time. I don't know why this one's so expensive. I guess just because people don't realize you can use Jaxi in Luigi's Balloon World. Like, some things they seem like they you know do allow and don't allow. You wanna expect with the things that they do allow that they would expect they would allow Jaxi, but they do. And that way we can save ourselves 14 seconds just running right on over there. Whoa, 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 he's stuck. Well, what was that about? That was weird. Maybe that's where the Odyssey is supposed to be, right? Oh, that's weird. Maybe there's like some kind of thing where he's not allowed to pass that because typically the Odyssey, that's really weird. Um, but there we go. So I think we'll leave it at that 8,400 coins. I did want to check out my stats one last time because I'm hoping the next episode will be the time I showcase what happens when you hit 50 stars, when you complete Luigi's Balloon World. As you can see, I've only gotten like 20 something balloons in today's episode, so I still have about another 152 to go, so yeah, it's gonna take some work, but I'll get there. As you can see, my highest number found in a row was 75, so if I could do that two times, I already got it done. You know, that still takes some time, but Eventually, yep, I know I'll lose my streak. But with that being said, we checked out the Harriet costume, it was very cool, we enjoyed some Sand Kingdom with a lot of fun balloons to find. With all that being said, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Super Mario Odyssey. If you watched this part of video, make sure you comment Harriet Zebra, so you've watched at the end of the you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye bye.